Good morning and welcome to another episode of Your Technology Questions Answered, hosted by yours truly, Steve Smith, aka Z-Axis, and yes, you may call me that, and today I'll be talking about AutoCAD software. I'll explain what it is, why it is used, explain what it is suited for, and finish with a free software solution to get you all started. What is AutoCAD? First, AutoCAD was developed and sold by Autodesk Incorporated first release in December of 1982. We can all agree that the auto in AutoCAD comes from the Autodesk Incorporated name. The CAD in AutoCAD means computer aided drafting. AutoCAD is essentially a 2D and 3D computer aided drafting software designed to help designers of hardware buildings, bridges, furniture, amusement parks, malls, strip malls, anything etc 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 to create virtual versions of planned creations what can AutoCAD be used for though AutoCAD can be used by anyone who wishes to build their own home design furniture cars bridges large buildings etc it is typically used though by civil engineers but anyone can use it to create a large array of projects when I say typically used by civil engineers what do I mean Civil engineering, which encompasses the buildings of house, malls, amusement parks, skyscrapers, overpasses, bridges, and etc. Use AutoCAD and various other similar software solutions to create these future projects to see just how they're going to look, act under various conditions, and plan for the developmental stages of construction. It also allows them to print 3D versions of various projects to Test with in such experiments like wind tunnel testing, which allows them to view just various stress points caused by high winds. So when I mean typically, I don't always mean always, but you understand what I mean. Who else can use AutoCAD? Anyone who has a reasonable familiarity with two-dimensional and three-dimensional concepts can use it. If you're planning on designing buildings like your own home, you will need to use your local town city or federal laws and bylaws to help you design your structures to code otherwise if you're if you understand the idea of building structures know what negative and positive space is and have a good imagination you can use AutoCAD to design anything for small businesses owners this means you can design your 3d business name sign for your commerce where can I get an AutoCAD software solution. Now, I typically say to buy directly from Autodesk, it being the original and best version to date that you can use, although there are many, they normally cost over a grand. However, for anyone who just wants to try it out, I do know of a free software solution called LibreCAD. Now, LibreCAD asks for a small donation if you really get into using it or start using LibCAD for commercial use. It's still free software because you're not really obliged to give anything one way or another. You can download LibCAD from L-I-B-R-E-C-A-D dot org. Next week, I'll get into instant messaging for anyone who is like me and who has just about every popular, not so popular, instant messaging client installed. You may want a simpler solution. Next week, I'll give you a few really awesome choices that allow you to chat seamlessly from, with anyone from any service you're using. If you wish to interact with the show, you can send me your questions, comments, stories, or suggestions over to tqa at zaxis.net. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and like this episode. By the way, to share this episode really easily with any of your friends, you need only go to the show notes page and share directly from there. All the related links and downloads and YouTube information is already on that particular page. For show notes, downloads, and more information, head over to www.zedaxis.net if you're feeling generous and want to help me make the show better. I've started a fundraiser on Facebook. 
also available on my website to help me pay for some new lights and a brand new portable camera. Anything you can give will be added to my budget to make the show bigger and better. Fundraiser uses PayPal to make the transfer so you know it is safe and secure. Be the first to help me out and I'll add the names of the people who helped me with the fundraiser in the credits of the show. So let's see you all here next week. Stay safe and online. Many thanks for listening, subscribing, and helping out with my fundraiser. Have an absolutely great day. Thank you.